Mastering reported speech in English. Hello language learners. Welcome to another exciting session of English grammar. Today we're focusing on a very essential and somewhat tricky part of English, reported speech. Don't worry if you've never heard of it before or find it difficult, because we're going to break it down for you piece by piece and by the end of this video, you'll have a firm grasp on it. Reported speech, also known as indirect speech, is when we tell someone what another person said. Sounds simple, right? Imagine this, your friend Alice tells you, I am happy. Later, you want to relay Alice's feelings to another friend, Bob. You don't quote Alice directly, but you say, Alice said she was happy. You just used reported speech. Notice something? We didn't use Alice's exact words, but we conveyed the same message. Also, we switched from am in Alice's direct speech to was in the reported speech. We'll delve into why we made that change in the next section. One important rule of reported speech is that we often shift the tenses back. This might sound confusing, but let's use the previous example for clarity. When Alice spoke, she said, I am happy. However, when you relayed her message, you said, Alice said she was happy. The present tense, am, changed to the past tense, was. This is a key feature of reported speech. We often, backshift, the tenses to show that the speech is not current, but happened in the past. Let's explore more examples to help cement your understanding. If your friend says, I will visit Paris next year, in reported speech, you might say, my friend said she would visit Paris the following year. Did you notice the two changes here? Will, changed to, would, and, next year, changed to, the following year. In reported speech, we often adjust time references along with tense changes. Another example. If your teacher says, you must complete this assignment tonight, you might tell your friend, the teacher said we had to complete the assignment that night. Alright, that brings us to the end of our introduction to reported speech. Remember, it's all about relaying what someone else said in your own words, with slight adjustments to tense and time references. Practice with more sentences and soon, it'll become second nature to you. I hope you found this video helpful. Keep practicing and you'll master reported speech in no time. Stay tuned for more English language learning content. Happy learning!